Hello, Damien Murray. Yeah. My name's Dr. Williams. I'm the duty psychiatrist. Uh, the casualty doctor asked if I could speak to you. Is that okay? Yeah. I understand that your sister's been quite concerned about you recently. Don't know, is she? Well, perhaps you could tell me what happened today. What do you mean with the food? Yeah. Well, it was bad, so I had to chuck it out. And how did you know it was bad? The barcodes. The barcodes? Yeah. Could you tell me a bit more about that? Well, they tell you stuff, don't they? Like codes. What sort of things? How much they cost and stuff. Anything else? Well, I know it sounds weird, but I've been noticing these patterns. Patterns? Hmm. And not just in the food either. And where else? Stuff on TV. The interference. Could you tell me a bit more? Well, you know when the screen goes all fuzzy? Mm -hmm. I've been noticing like a pattern, like dots and dashes and stuff, a code. And does this code mean anything? Dunno. I think, I think it's just a warning, warning me about something. About what? Just telling me to watch my back, I think. I don't know, maybe I'll, maybe I'll find out more later. Sounds a bit frightening. Yeah, well, how would you like it if you had the Secret Service after you? No, I wouldn't like it at all, but how do you know the Secret Service are after you? Well, I don't know who else it could be. Well, could there be another explanation? I don't know. Who, who else has that technology? Hmm. How are they doing this? Well, you know those TV detective vans? Yeah. Well, there was one in our street about a month ago. I reckon they must have fixed onto my television or something and, and they may be sending the signals that way. I see. So what are they sending? Just codes. And how long's this been going on for? Couple of months. Okay. Can I just check I've got this right? You say for about a couple of months now, um, You've been noticing codes on the TV and food, and you believe that the Secret Service are behind it? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, can I just check I've got this right? You say for about a couple of months now, um, you've been noticing codes on the TV and food, and you believe that the Secret Service are behind it? Yeah. Yeah. So why do you think this is happening? I don't know. Why me? Is there something special or different about you? No. Not really. It sounds like you're a bit worried that something might happen to you. <laughs> yeah, well, like I said, I'm scared. And what are you scared of? <sighs> something bad might happen. Are you worried that someone might want to harm you? Well, that's what it feels like. That's why I had to chuck the food out. What was wrong with the food? Well, I don't know. It could have been contaminated or tampered with. And who'd done that? My mum bought it. Do you think your mum's involved? I don't know, but... I do think that maybe she's been watching me a bit too much lately. Right. Is that why you put a bolt on your bedroom door recently? Yep. I didn't want her snooping around in my room. Are you worried that she might want to harm you? I don't know, but she might be reporting back to them. Do you think she's been tampering with your food? I don't know, I don't know, right, but... I mean, maybe she didn't know the food was dodgy. But she's the one who bought it, though, isn't she? Mm, but could there be another explanation? How do you mean? Well, it's a bit unusual, isn't it, to have your food interfered with? Yeah, and I was, I was shocked to think about it, but I don't know how it could be any other way. I mean, is it possible that uh, the food wasn't tampered with after all? What, 
Are you saying that I'm making this up? No, no, not at all. It's obviously uh, very frightening for you. Yeah, I'll say. But, you know, say if somebody told you a similar story six months ago, what would you have thought? Yeah, all right. I mean, maybe it does sound a bit unbelievable at first. Is there still a part of you that finds it difficult to accept? No. I mean, I wake up sometimes in the night and think this can't be happening, but but it is, and I, I, I just don't know why. I just can't seem to understand it. Okay. Well, thanks very much for talking to me.